Israel and the militant group Hamas remain at war. And today I'm getting perspective from Toledo's Jewish community. I talked to Daniel Perlman, who is the vice president of community and government relations for the Jewish Federation of Greater Toledo. First off, he tells me that he condemns the acts by Hamas and demands an end to the continual loss of innocent lives. Oh, it definitely hits home. He tells me that the Jewish Federation of Greater Toledo, quote, stands with everyone. And here's the thing, this isn't a 2D dispute. There are many lives that are being impacted, some lives lost, some lives completely flipped upside down, and other lives that are being held hostage in Gaza. The atrocities that were committed by Hamas on October 7th amounted to the deadliest day in Jewish history since the Holocaust. And, you know, we also know that we're not the only group that is hurting right now, that's in pain right now. Uh, we know that our Muslim friends, our Arab friends, Palestinian American neighbors are facing bigotry, threats and violence as well. One other thing he said was, quote, Israel's enemy is not the Palestinian people. It can be very easy to put two sides against each other. But the situation here is far more complex. And as you've heard in my previous reporting, there are many people that simply want Palestinians to have their own independence. And it's, of course, important to recognize the difference between Hamas and Palestinians. A lot of people think that this is just the most recent round of what they consider to be a cycle of violence between Israelis and Palestinians. And, and I actually want to push back on that a second. I think this instance and what happened on October 7th is truly unique. Um, this was literally one of the worst terrorist attacks in human history by death count, right? With over 1,400 people murdered by a terrorist organization. Very few terrorist attacks in human history have been larger than that. One other important takeaway from our conversation is that hate crimes against both Jews and Muslims are actually up, especially in the wake of this war. Reporting in Sylvania, I'm Jaden Jefferson.